Alright, this is my whole setup that I use in hygiene. The parts you see here, this is the Kona tube kit, all the way up to here. This is a SC HPE adapter. That's not my product, you have to buy that from, you can get it from Practicon for about 15 bucks. This is the Kona uh, block tube set, and the Kona block itself. And I have two uh, total comfort saliva ejectors attached. The way I use it for hygiene basically is I have a suction mirror, autoclavable suction mirror that I get for 36 bucks. And you can attach it right to this. So you get HVE power, suction power, with a very flexible tube. And the whole thing can be autoclaved, which is nice. So I use this for the back, for the uh, posterior sextants to scale. And then I just detach and put this in the same uh, adapter and use the Kona block for the anterior teeth to scale. It's a very quick, efficient system, very cheap to buy, the whole system. You get 36 bucks, so tube kit 49 bucks, HVE SE adapter is 15 bucks, the tube set's 19, and the Kona block is 24. And this whole thing, except for the slide rejectors, can be autoclave. And very efficient, very nice, and that's how I use it. And I'm going to show you a quick video after of me just using this and uh, so you get an idea how it works. Thanks. Okay. Break down a little bit. Okay. Here I'm using the uh, suction there. Which is not recommended because it just takes up more room. With the corner block, you just use a regular standard mirror. And you can see me, I'm spraying the, uh, the mirror with water because I didn't wipe the mirror against the patient's cheek or lip. It helps a lot and it will give you a much clearer view. The nice thing about the, the corner block is. You can scale from first first premolar to first premolar on most patients without stopping. And the two slide rejectors really you know, suck up the saliva and the water. Alright, open. I'm gonna switch. So here I'm just switching over to the suction mirror. Just unhooking the Kona block tube set and just hooking in the uh, suction mirror. Which gives you nice, good, uh, strong HVE suction. Mm -hmm. With a flexible hole a little bit. Yeah. This position right here is probably the most effective use of the suction mirror. You can just really scale the molars very well, non-stop, and it really suctions up everything. I know it's tough to see here because the light is not that great. I'm going to lean this way a little bit. And then close like halfway. My movements here are a little bit awkward because the, uh, I'm using the iPhone to record the video and it's, I have it attached to the overhead light and it's very close to the patient right now. So it's actually getting in the way of me working. So it'll just be a lot smoother than normally. Here, yeah, nice view actually of the buckle of the upper molars. So you get good view with suction while you're scaling. And every now and then you just have the patient close down on the suction there. It's also like right here, I'm getting the distal of the last molar. Right. These suction mirrors are probably the best thing you can use for that. You can actually see what you're doing. And this uh, short clip, I'm just showing how well the the uh, corner block does suction. You can literally rinse the teeth and, and the patient's not really feeling anything going down her throat. So, again, just you know, spraying all the teeth. It works really well. So if you guys have any questions, you can just uh, you know, check out the website or send me an email. Thank you.